Africa has achieved a lot in the past 50 years, including freeing itself from colonialism, tackling security issues and finally recording encouraging economic growth. As the African Union prepares to celebrate 50 years in service, CCTV brings you an exclusive interview with the Union's Commission Deputy Chair, Erastus Mwencha, on the organization's achievements. For the last 50 years, Africa has uh, uh, traveled uh, the, the, the road of uh, development, integration, uh, peace and security in the continent, and many other aspects, uh, facets of life. And, and, and so this is a good moment uh, for Africa to say, where, are we, where should we have been? Uh, how, what were the missed opportunities? What, what, what are the assets that we have that should take us forward? So the, the, the celebrations will take, uh, call it three questions in one. One is to celebrate the fact that Africa has attained 50 to celebrate our leaders, the, those who struggled for independence, those uh, who uh, founded the union that we now uh, are you know, developing. But at the same time, look at us and, 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 and also take stock of the assets we have. Then using the past and the present, do a projection for the future and say, where do we want to be in the next 20, 50 years now? What do we need to take us to that next level of our development? And then, of course, invoke the spirit that enabled us to gain independence. If you go back in the 40s, in the 50s, our founding fathers, our founding mothers, the freedom fighters were inspired by the spirit of Pan-Africanism. And we said in the, you know, since the last decade, the last, we need a renaissance to take us back to that spirit of Pan Africanism, where Africa, we said, even one country still under colonialism or apartheid, Africa was still not free. Then we should have that spirit inspiring us to say, even one African country still not united living under threat of peace and security, not secure in any form, it is still Africa that is affected, that we can have that solidarity to move forward together.